What the hell was that just now? Goodbye. Well then, if you'll excuse me. Hey! <laughs> okay, bye. bye. <laughs> <laughs> Hi! What you guys have to Hollywood? <laughs> I actually did fuck off, but I just rolled with it. That's so good! <laughs> Could it be? Ah, uh, yeah, now I get it. The whole- this whole thing was just to get us all pumped up for the entrance- for the entrance ceremony. <laughs> Man, thank god it was all a joke. I'd be totally freaked out if it was real. You know? Alright, I guess I'll head out too. I wonder what they got planned for us next. Huh. Uh... Damn, I was totally looking forward to that nap too. Why'd they have to go and kill the moon? Huh? Don't wait for me. I wanna go with you. <laughs> that is that then. I will see you all there. Anyway! Not that anyone cares, but I I'm gonna go too. <laughs> Everyone took off for the gym and I was frozen where I stood. That uneasy feeling I'd had before, I couldn't get it out of my mind. And it looked like I wasn't the only one. Uh, um... This... this doesn't seem right. This is bad. Yeah, that announcement was totally weird. However... Maybe, but just staying put doesn't mean we'll be safe. Besides, aren't you guys just a little bit curious to find out what's going on around here? I see. If we do not move forward, we learn nothing. The only choice is to push ahead. I... I guess she's right, but still, I'm kind of, no, really nervous. We don't have a choice. We have to go. Leave it to most of the ladies to say <laughs> I <laughs> know. They have a bad <laughs> feeling about this shit. But <laughs> Bless the instinct. They said to go to the gym, right? Saving. Let's speak to everybody before we go, because it might be funny. <laughs> go first. This is bad. What was with that announcement? It was like totally creepy. Duh, shit. Shit. What the hell kind of game are they playing? I love him. I love him. <laughs> I like that I can swear. <laughs> <laughs> What the hell? Is this some kind of bad joke? <laughs> I know a bad joke. <laughs> I know several. Knock knock. Um. <laughs> <laughs> that is what one says. Who's there? Go on. <laughs> Who's there? Interrupting cow. <laughs> Interrupting cow. <No>. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like he'd be the one to be like, see, it's funny because. <laughs> yes, you would. <laughs> Something weird is going on here, right? It's not just me. I have to like do the little like okay hand, like shaking the fingers. <laughs> oh, you have to <laughs> every time. Listen, I know how you feel, but. All we can do now is check it out, right? <laughs> Interrupting cow. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sorry. I'm trying to pull it together. <clears throat> True. If we do not move forward, we learn nothing. The only choice is to push ahead. Well... Are you okay? Is everyone okay? I- I meant to make him sound a little more nasally and high-pitched, but I think I accidentally made him sound like that one dweeb from the Polar Express. Oh. <laughs> I also don't know how to leave the room. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to leave the room! Uh, exit, I think. Oh. Holy cow, what is with this huge metal hatch? Looks like the kind of thing you'd see in a secret military base or something. This is the same main hall I was in before, right? The store definitely wasn't here then, though. 
Have you pressed the circle and get it? Alright, where did they say that we should go? The gym. The gym. We've seen that door before. Boom, 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 boom. I don't know what music's playing because it's muted, so I'm there just gonna make my own. <laughs> Perfect. That's exactly what it sounds like. <laughs> Alright, let's go back to the gym. Hey, come on! Hey, come on! God, I had no idea this Hope's Peak Academy place was gonna be such a pain in my balls. Welcome back, then! It really ain't much... It really ain't that much different from the time I spent in Juvie. Hell, this place is even worse. Did y'all make a very yet? bad joke? We did. <laughs> yes, we, we were told a very bad joke by Taka. <laughs> well, we... Okay, we, we heard him over the intercom. We haven't, like, seen him face to face yet. We're about to enter the gym, and I assume meet him for the first time. Uh, um... And why isn't there anyone here? Walking through the halls, I didn't see a single person. She's got a very good This is bad. I think of Kerrigan, Jesus fucking Christ. Uh... Isn't that, like, seriously not good? <laughs> That's why. Uh, they're just trying to spook us. They'll take those metal plates down later, I'm sure of it. Oh, such a positive thinker. I love that stupid bastard bear. Super fun to cosplay, too. I bet. He looks like he'd be a fun, like, pajama cosplay. You know what I mean? The, like, footy pajamas with the hood that has the face of the character on it. Huh. <clears throat> All we can do now is hope for the best and prepare for the worst. And nothing ventured, nothing gained. <laughs> Shit. Oh, hell, it ain't like I'm scared or nothing. Let's just get this over with. I do love the fact that, like, when you voice the characters, you're taking it so seriously, and me, I'm just a caricature for every single character. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, you can do way more voices than I can. Like, you, you can play around with your voice. I just drop or low, like, I just either lower or heighten my voice. I can't do accents or anything. I can't even do a very good valley girl, so I can't do Junko either. Hey, damn it! Hey! Where's whoever called us here? What are you thinking? Mondo, stop! No running! This well, looks like a job for the whole monitor! <laughs> I'll shut. I too shall go. Hey, wait! Don't leave me here all alone. Except for that guy. That guy, I, I was like, how shitty hey. can I make my voice? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> hey, wait. The, the, the Skeletor <laughs> phenomenon. <laughs> okay, time for some more tutorial action. You can press the triangle button to observe the room you're in. Observing will display what people and objects you can interact with. Sorry for the late notice. I think Robot Girl is my favorite voice. Oh, I love how they're literally just 2D people. Mm -hmm. And they're all you. It's your time to me. shine, Jack. Here we go. Here we fucking go. Here we fucking go. But Kyoko is kind of normal voice, though. Yeah. Done. Total silence. For whatever reason, she's the only one managing to stay calm. Maybe I'm just imagining. All the other students. Why are we the only ones here? It was. This is right. bad. <laughs> I'm totally getting a bad vibe right now. Perfect. A display case. There are all kinds of trophies and plaques inside. Of course, all the students who go here are ultimate, right? So this is probably just a tiny fraction of all their rewards. They got, they got him on. Oh, they even got onesies off him. That makes sense. Oh, oops! I didn't realize I could the same thing. Sorry. Let's go to the TV. School has a lot of TVs. 
They couldn't all just be for that weird school broadcast, could they? We got a big storm coming. <laughs> <laughs> Another surveillance camera. I feel like we're being watched every second. I don't like it. I don't blame you, Beach. Ah, the door. Here we go. You have to tell me when the bear stops talking. Okay. Screams on mute. Will do. Still filled with uneasy dread, I did what the announcement said and went to the gym. And I saw what was waiting for us there. What was waiting for us? Oh. It really does look like an entrance ceremony. Yo! See? I told ya! It's, total, it's totally normal entrance ceremony stuff. Hero was right. But in a way, that just emphasized how completely not normal all of us were. Hey there! Howdy! Hello! Is everyone here? Good! Then let's get things rolling! The tonal shift in art is incredible. Whoop! <laughs> Hello there! Huh? A uh, teddy bear? I'm not a teddy bear. Okay, they're all speaking their lines right now. I am Monokuma! Monokuma time! Yes, sir. And I am this school's headmaster! Oh, good. It was the strangest thing I'd ever seen. Right before my eyes, it was... What I was seeing was... It was... Utterly incomprehensible. Nice to meet you all! Such a bright voice and carefree attitude was completely out of place. And all that anxiety I'd been carrying with me suddenly transformed into outright fear. Say what? What? That teddy bear can talk! <laughs> Calm down. I'm sure there's just a speaker inside it. Hey! Come on now! Okay, he's not speaking now. I told you already, I'm not a teddy bear. Headmaster. <laughs> I'm Monokuma, and I'm your headmaster. That's such a good voice. <laughs> oh god, I absolutely love Monokuma. His personality is so batshit, it's my favorite thing. I'm very oh, excited for him. That's very what? What? It moves! <laughs> Seriously, man, calm down. It's probably just a remote control toy or something. <laughs> How dare you compare me to a child's plaything? You've cut me deep, deeper than the Mariana Trench. <laughs> My remote control system is so complex, even the folks at NASA can't recreate or even comprehend it. Jesus Christ. But don't make me say stuff that might destroy NASA's dreams. I just couldn't bear that. Oh, oh boy. Yeah. Oh, boy. Persona Force Teddy all over again. <laughs> all right, here we go. Bear that. Really? You are unfortunate. Hmm. Now then, moving on. We really must hurry and get started. Come on. Giving up already? No other stupid bear pun? <laughs> yeah, basically, Teddy. <laughs> now then! Quiet down now, quiet down! Okay, so... <laughs> he has abandoned the gag. Good morning! Everyone, stand at attention and bow, and good morning! You hear me? What a kiss ass. Jesus Christ, Taka. <laughs> What's oh, your problem? <laughs> you don't have to say it back. Now then. Now then, let us commence with a most noteworthy and memorable entrance ceremony. First, let's talk a bit about what your school life here will be like. Now, uh, make no mistake, you few students, so full of potential, represent the hope of the world. Hi, DJ! 
one of my favorite games. Series you're in for such a ride. I am so excited. It's already been quite the trip. <laughs> I apologize. I'm ruining it. Already. No, no, you are and not. You're making it better. <laughs> and to protect such splendid hope, you will all live a communal life together solely within the confines of this school. Oh, perfect. It's reality TV. Everyone will live in harmony together and adhere to the rules and regulations of the school. Huh? Hmm. Ah, now then. Regarding the end date for this communal life... Too bad! There isn't one! In other words, you'll all be here until the day you die. Such is the school life we've been assigned. What did he just say? Until the day we decide? Yep. Oh, but fear not. We have quite an abundant budget, so oh, you won't last for all the common conveniences. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on a second. That's the least of our worries right now. Hmm. Yeah, what the hell? You're saying I have to live here for our? Ah! You're screwing with us, Rat. Rat? It's <laughs> true! I am not screwing with you! I am no liar! Of that you can be 100% sure! Uh-huh! Ah! And just for your information, you're completely cut off from the outside world! You don't have to worry about that dirty, dirty land beyond these, beyond, beyond, oh well, beyond these walls ever again. Cut off. This world doesn't matter place all over the school. They're there to keep us trapped in here? Phew! <clears throat> That's exactly what they're there for. Good. No matter how much you may yell and scream for help, Help will not come. <laughs> so, with all of that in mind, feel free to live out your life here with reckless abandon. Hey, come on. Come on, what the hell is this? I don't care if the school or whoever else is behind all this. This is just a really bad joke. I love how Monokuna is like, yeah, you're all here until you die, and the music is just... <laughs> <laughs> ba -ba 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 -ba. <laughs> She's busting down. <laughs> Shaking my ass to the Monokuma thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so good. Damn you! Yeah, cut this shit out. It isn't funny anymore. Unbelievable. You keep saying this is a lie or a joke. A bunch of skeptics, all of you. What are you gonna do? But I guess you can't help it, huh? You all grew up in an age when you're taught to doubt your neighbor. <laughs> Throwing that shit in a circle. <laughs> Good. Well, you'll have plenty of time to find out whether or not I, what I say is true. And when that time comes, you'll see with your own eyeballs that I speak the undeniable truth. Most unfortunate. Having to live here forever would be quite a problem. What's this? Come now, what's the matter with all of you? <laughs> you decided of your own free will to attend Hope Speak Academy, didn't you? I swear to God, next time I cosplay stream, I'm just gonna start twerking when his theme plays. <laughs> do it, Van, do it. <laughs> Before the entrance ceremony is even finished, you've already decided you want to leave. Hey, um. Oh, but you know. Oh no. I guess I did forget to mention one thing. There is one way for you to leave the school. This bear is giving me like battle royale vibes. <laughs> really? Actually. Headmaster, I've crafted a special clause for those of you who would like to leave. I call it the graduation 
Exclamation clause. Now then. Now, let me tell you about this fun little rule. As I mentioned, in order to maintain an environment of harmony here, we rely on a communal lifestyle. And if someone were to disrupt that harmony, they, and they alone, would be allowed to leave the school. Was I right? That, my students, is the graduation clause. What? What do you mean by disrupt the harmony? <laughs> <laughs> well, you know. Oh my god, I am right. This is Battle Royale. Oh my god! If one person were to murder another! I knew it. Murder? Yes, indeed! Stabbing, strangling, bludgeoning, crushing, hacking, drowning, igniting? How you doing? It doesn't matter! You must kill someone if you want to leave. It's as simple as that. <laughs> the rest is up to you. Give it your all to achieve the best outcome in the worst way possible. A chill shot down my spine. You must kill someone if you want to leave. As soon as I heard those words, my blood went cold. <laughs> <laughs> I bet that got your brain juices flowing. Beat the heck out of a human catching a salmon, huh? What? Like I said before, you guys are the hope of the world. But you know... Taking that hope and seeing it get murdered creates a darkened shadow of despair. EXTREME! And I just find that so darn exciting! What the hell? What the hell are you talking about? To keep... To kill each other is... It's... Huh? To kill each other is to kill each other. I'm sure there's a dictionary here somewhere if you need it. <laughs> what are you saying? We know what it means. That's not the problem. Why do we have to kill each other? Say what? Yeah. Stop blabbering on with all this nonsense. Just let us go home already. Blabbering? Blabbering? Ugh. Blabbering? Blabbering? What stop. do you mean, blabbering? Stop blabbering on about blabbering on! Oh, okay. Imagine being told you gotta kill someone to leave the school by a fucking teddy bear. Yeah. <laughs> okay, now he's not laughing. You guys just don't get it, do you? Let us go! Let us go! You keep saying the same thing over and over and over and over. Listen, from this moment on, this school is your home, your life, your world. Got it? Yahoo! And you can kill as much as you want to kill! So go ahead, go on a kill kill killing spree! Uh. Alright, come on. How long are you going to keep this up? Hmm? Eh? You know? Alright, you got us, okay. You scared the hell out of us, so you can go ahead and reveal the trick now. Reveal the trick? I'm you? right, right? Yeah, because I mean, you know, this is all some kind of trick and all, right? So, uh, like... Dude, shut the hell up and get out of my way. Shoving Hero aside, Mondo places himself in front of Monokuma, his voice rumbling like thunder. You're fucking dead. Listen up, asshole. This shit's gone way too far. What the hell kind of joke is this? What's the matter? Joke? What? You mean like your hair? Woo! You son of a bitch! Ugh! Mono roared out, but then there was a sudden boom. There was a sound of floorboards as he kicked off and launched himself into the air. He flew at Monokuma, fast and straight as a bullet. He locked onto his target. Gotcha, you little piece of shit! I don't know if you're a toy or a stuffed animal or whatever the hell. Okay, there's two. Either way, I'm gonna rip you to fucking shreds! I love that. What? <laughs> Violence against the headmaster is in violation of school regulations! Shut the fuck up! Let me out of here, I swear to Christ! Okay, 
And now they're not speaking. Hey, damn it! <sighs> what? No smart ass comeback this time? Oh no. Piece of shit! Stop that goddamn beeping and say something! Watch out! Watch out! Get rid of it! Huh? Huh? Hurry up and throw it! I don't know if her ferocity stunned him into silence or what, but without a word, he did what he was told. He... threw Monokuma. Bomokuna. And as soon as he did... <laughs> the hell? What the? That sure as shit wasn't a joke. It blew the hell up. There was a painful ringing in my ears, and I could smell gunpowder. Explosions might happen all the time in movies or whatever, but when it's in real life, I'd never seen anything like it. But, but you know, this means that the teddy bear's been destroyed, right? Hey! I told you, I'm not a teddy bear. I'm Monokuma. Uh, there's another one? D damn you! you son of a bitch, you seriously tried to kill me just now! <laughs> If Monokuma fucking dies. Of course! <laughs> well, yes. I was serious about trying to kill you. You did violate one of the school regulations, after all. I'll uh, let you off with a warning this time. But you'd better be careful from now on. Any naughty boy or girl who violates my rules won't get off with just a little smut in the butt. This is bad. Hey, so does this mean there's, like, a bunch more of you around somewhere? <laughs> yep. Monokumas have been placed all throughout the school, yes. Yes, don't forget the surveillance cameras installed everywhere. Oh boy. And if you're caught breaking any rules, well... You all just saw what happened, right? <laughs> <laughs> and next time I won't be so forgiving with my punishment. So don't let it happen again. Huh? That's not even punishment, that's just wrong. Well? Now then, lastly, to commemorate your joyous entry into our school, I have a little something for you. This is our official student handbook. Pretty cool, huh? As you can see, it's fully digital. So naturally, we call it... The E-Handbook. Not the I-Handbook, or we'll get sued. <laughs> ah, yes, well, moving on. This handbook is absolutely vital to a healthy school life, so don't lose it! When you start it up, it will display your name. Always make sure you have the right one. <laughs> now, this is not your everyday notebook. It has so many more uses than that. What? Also, it's completely waterproof. Splash it, wash it, drown it, it'll thaw the ticket. You're breaking up a little bit. Break. Oh, sorry. Okay. Very resistant! <laughs> it contains all of our school regulations, so make sure you review them thoroughly. You guys? You'll hear me say this a lot, but any violation of school regulations will not be tolerated. <sighs> Shing! Rules restrict, yes. But they also protect society, for example, with the utter chaos without law. Yes, indeed! The same thing applies here, which is why it's crucial we have strict punishments in place for violators. Okay, well, that brings our entrance ceremony to a close. Bye-bye! Please enjoy your abundantly dreary school life, and... <laughs> see ya!
And with that, he was gone, leaving us all with a state of shock. State of shock. So, guys, how would you define what he just experienced? <laughs> what the crap? How? Why? I don't understand any of this. Huh? Do we have to live here forever? Or kill? <laughs> what? What just happened? Calm down. Everyone, we need to just calm down. First, let's just take a second to summarize everything we just heard. Based on what Monokuma said, we essentially have two choices. Choice number one is that we each stay here, living a communal life together until the day we die. And the other choice is... Indeed. If we want to get out of here alive, we have to kill someone, right? That's... But... Killing someone... That's... Like, <laughs> We were abducted out of nowhere and stuffed into this placement to... Meant to look like a school. And now we're supposed to start killing each other? This is... This is... This is just... What is this? Ridiculous! A lie is what it is. All these ridiculous things we've heard. This all has to be fake. Hmm. Right now, it doesn't really matter if it's real or fake. What matters so is... So, in other words... Is there anyone who's seriously considering all this? To that, nobody had a response. Eat the rich. <laughs> Starts with you, asshole. Keeping quiet. <laughs> Keeping quiet myself, I look around at the others. Yeah, the middle is not a good place to be, Makoto. They all stared at one another, trying to gauge each other's thoughts. I could almost taste of hostility. And that's when it hit me. I realized the true horror hidden within the rules that I had laid out. You must kill someone if you want to leave. Those words had planted vicious thoughts deep within each of us. Each of us had has become suspicious of everyone else. We were forced to wonder, is somebody going to betray us? Hydrate or dehydrate, thank you, man. <sighs> and that was how my new school life began. This school, which had come out of nowhere to raise my hopes so high, it's not a school of hope. It's a school of despair.